Yeah, as I'm sitting in this car waiting on something, I see why my ex didn't want me in these streets. They love me out here. <laughs> Nikki here and this vlog will be brought to you by Beauty Forever Hair. So if you're interested, please continue to watch. First up, I'm going to take my foundation, I'm going to put it on the back of my hand just a little bit, thin it out with my finger, then put it in the brush because I don't want it to go on too liquidy and go through the lace and tint the inside of my lace. Just get it on evenly. This is a fairly wig, easy wig to put on and I don't have to do much like glue it down or whatever. I might end up still spraying it down, but I'm gonna show you guys how to wear it with the ear tabs. Okay, darlings, I've added the adjustable band at the back. I love these wigs because the knots are pre-bleached. It is pre-plucked, the hairline. The lace is even pre-cut, so you really just put them on. First step, I'm just gonna fit it to my head and hopefully the ear tabs aren't wacky because they already stuck some of the tape on them. Oh, they're perfect. Oh, wow. Why can't they make all the regular wigs like this? <laughs> just like any other wig, I'm just going to comb all of this out for my face so I can see what I'm working with and pin it up. I always take a wax stick and don't worry, everything I use is always linked below the video. There's going to be a tab that takes you to my Amazon store and it will say hair product shoes in the video. So that helps me push that more out of my face. Then I brush it back because I really need to see what I'm doing, guys. Next step, please make sure your head or your forehead and or whatever is clear of anything. And I do have makeup on. So I'm li literally going to take a makeup remover wipe. Take off all makeup that's like on this hairline that might get in the way. I didn't even unfold it because I don't I don't want the makeup remover to run. So also makeup remover is a little oily. So I just take one of these makeup remover tabs like this and go back along and make sure there's not like any oil residue. You can always take alcohol. Let's see what we have. Let's make sure this is positioned good, guys. So I'm just gonna flip it in like this. Let's just brush all this hair back too. And we're gonna take one pill. And we're just gonna adhere it to my head. Tight as possible. So they did give you extra tape, but as you can see, this tape is not budging, chef. <laughs> oh my gosh. Okay, even though I didn't technically like gel or glue or anything, anything down, I am still gonna put the band on so the tape could go ahead and like to the head. <laughs> if the, you know, let's just go and do that. So while that's doing that, I'm gonna take some spray so this could lay how I like it to lay. <laughs> this is body wave, so y'all know I ain't doing nothing to it, right? Y'all know I like my body wave to just flow, right? Bum wig, y'all. And it came with so much extra tape. 
go back in with this wax stick y'all know how i like my stuff to lay flat flat i already pre-parted two middle part but you can move that part around we're gonna go back in with our foundation and cover that up so I just put that on and cover that lace some more so this is that's the lace tinted and that's without look at that and all i did was took it down y'all know i'm gonna take my infamous flat urn that has the hot comb on the outside though and try to oh make that a little flatter i love this like really i just threw it on and pushed some tape down i absolutely love this but yes if i get it again i would have to get a little bit more length we don't we don't do these little short wigs anymore so i take my wax stick and put it like in the palm of my hand and then rub my hands together and do this too all right guys so that's this quick tape installation let me know how you guys feel about the wig let me know how you guys feel about the technique beauty forever has all type of hair guys i have probably reviewed for them over 50 times no joke um they have payment options quad split pay whatever you want to do if you don't want to pay for the wig all up front and they just have a variety of wigs over there for you to choose from so i will leave this wig below more information about beauty forever below a discount code below if they provide me with one and let's move on into the video oh hey y'all it's your little auntie the one that looked just like too young for her age but i'm still real real little we're starting a new vlog i have no idea what this vlog is going to hold because like i told you in another vlog i no longer look ahead in my calendar it just gives me anxiety anxiety so today i look at what i gotta do tomorrow tomorrow i look at what i gotta do the next day but y'all yeah, always know i got something popping it is horrible in texas right now it's either raining ice and snowing raining ice and snowing and baby we used to the 110s so we don't know where um what's we don't know who who put voodoo on us because this ain't our weather but we gonna make it through it so i just got done doing this try on but it was at the beginning of my last vlog and so i got a couple of things i want to show you guys and then we can move on into the vlog her huge all right so you guys remember another vlog i showed you this t-shirt right here it's like the it girl t-shirt that's going on right now the gag gives you supposed to get it for your man honey and make your man word or your woman whatever whatever you do whatever you do but child why sticker meal i tell you guys about them all the time they're a company where you can get stickers envelopes tapes and all that for your business every week they run a special so they run a special they ran a special on their t-shirts and so child i try to make my own and that's why you stay in your own motherfucking lane let this be a lesson to y'all girl girl i mean it's still cute it's still cute honey but uh it ain't it ain't getting what the company i got the shirt from gang you see like i should have like um png this a little bit more but hey it works out because remember i told y'all that nicole wanted this shirt <laughs> she can get this one, okay <laughs> and dossier will be sponsoring yet another video this is their third sponsorship this month so what they tell me y'all buying the heck out of this dossier like i ain't never had no three dossier sponsorships in one month but y'all need to because this stuff is bomb. So let me grab the new stuff that they sent me really quick. So if you didn't know, Dossier is a fragrance company or a fragrance company that has some of our favorite inspirations of some of our favorite fragrances. Okay. Their bottles start at $29 a bottle. Not only do they sell perfume, they sell candles, they sell um diffusers you can get packs if you, you can get discounts the more you buy just know if you are using one of their discounts on the website my code would not apply a lot of you guys have been asking about that and they are just a great company guys i love dossier of course i talk about them every video even if it's not sponsored i swear i do so let me show you what i got you can get them in walmart you can get them in Am on amazon but why would you okay no mind let me not say that let me, let me, let me not say that Sorry, that's it. But Walmart and Amazon, you ain't gonna get no discount. Go through the website, okay? So I got 
three diffusers. <laughs> I'm obsessed with these things because I have been noticing when you burn cheap candles in your house, it gives off a soup and it's turning my wall colors. And so, yeah, I'm like, and then I've been watching all these videos on TikTok and they say you're not supposed to breathe that stuff from them candles and it's making me paranoid. So anyway, this is Ambery Vanilla. This is my absolute favorite one. It is inspired by YSL Black Opium. That's my favorite one. You guys know that. No, I, I just love these things. And they're not going to be boom, bam, pow when you walk in the house lit like a candle. But they give you a nice siage in your house that you get a glimpse of every now and then. Put them in your bathroom. Trust me. You'll thank me later. So this one right here is Amber Cherry. I got another one. I love this one in my bathroom. Lost Cherry inspired yeah i had this in my bathroom one time and i woke up and was like oh i smell good what is this girl with me it was this coming all the way out my bathroom and the last one i got is a new one i want to try it is da, 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 woody sandalwood inspired by le labo centaur 33 you guys will love this one i know you will I don't know why they tried to play me like that on camera. It even looked different. This one is round. Like, y'all see the difference? Maybe. There we go. So that is one of y'all favorite scents, especially for the home. So I know you will enjoy that. I did get two fragrances. So I got a Dossier Original. I think it's Amber and something. And I loved it. So I was like, let me get some more of their fragrances to try this is their wellness collection and this one right here is rose and basil bliss now guys i went by the one that had the highest ratings but um it's not my cup of tea it's not my cup of tea i think the basil is throwing me off a little bit and of course if you know platinum d the platinum d the nikki darden you know that i am not gonna let dossier send me anything without sending me another amber saffron stop playing with me stop playing some one of you guys told me y'all was on y'all fifth bottle of this and it's the best thing on the website no shade that i see so also i wanted to update you guys which i don't have because my daughter took it i can't have nothing dossier heads up in his house aromatic star anise which is inspired by dior sauvage let me tell you something when I told y'all how good this smelled, I hadn't burnt it yet. This throw, I had to give it to my dog. It, it, it was so loud in a good way. It was so loud. And I was like, this is my daughter type of candle. My daughter loves candles that has like a mm to them. So I have placed another order and I'm going to try some more scents for you guys. But if you are that person that needs to cover certain smells in your house, I ain't going to say it on her. Puff, puff, pass. That's my story and I'm sticking to it. Dossier link will be below. <laughs> I got a new mirror. I showed you guys in my last vlog. Y'all, I don't know about this mirror, though. I thought the plant looked better over there. Sorry, the camera is shaking. I thought the plant looked better over there, but I need a mirror, child. Girl, this dress is cute. Oh, actually, this is, uh, actually, um, this is lingerie, but, yeah. I think I'm just lazy, but I think I want to box it up and get the one that's the size bigger. But I'm so lazy and I want to have to box that back up take it back that I'm damn near finna just put it somewhere else in the house and just buy the other one instead of exchanging it. That's too lazy, y'all. I ain't the, <laughs> I'll never have that much money. We'll figure out what we're gonna do. But I gotta work and edit real quick, so I'll see y'all later on today. We were supposed to go to the eye doctor today, but I like, uh -uh, I ain't getting out. Uh-uh. I said, excuse me, reschedule. And ASAP. <laughs> well, I look like slipping and sliding in these streets. <laughs> <laughs> all right guys really quick let's discuss last vlog's perfume tray they were all purple i mean because why not so if you want to know about any of these fragrances you're going to have to check out last vlog how they performed so what i'm going to start doing is telling y'all my top off the tray like if you had to pick one we're going to go with this whopper right here 
This is Jasmine Wisp, and it is a scent you can purchase from Amazon. This is Juice Box Feather Supreme, Versace Dylan Purple, Gucci Gorgeous Magnolia, Montal Sensual Instinct, and Montal Intense Cafe. Okay, all of them did the dang thing, but top pick, top pick is this one right here. So let's build a new tray. Maya, your lunch is ready. Pick a color, any color. Pick a color. Pink. Ugh, I know you were going to say that. <laughs> yeah, why she done went and got her a Stanley Cup? First of all. Uh-uh. <laughs> First of all, why you done got, went and got your Stanley Cup man on her? Because it's pink. <laughs> so what color did you say? Pink? Or do, uh, do white. White, white, goldy. White, white okay. Gold. Be right back. So let's talk about it. Should say let's go with the white and gold. So we're going to go with this scent right here from Amazon, which is called Quad Owl Fusan. If I'm pronouncing that wrong, I'm so sorry. We have Mont Blanc right here, which is one of my absolute favorites that I hardly ever reach for. Velvet Tonka by BDK. This is an Amazon scent right here called Yara. I think it has another name behind it, but it's one of the Yaras. Cassiopeia, Baltiziana Terenzi, and Mansara Instant Crush. This is a beautiful tray. Oh, I'm finna smell. Oh, I'm finna smell so good. <laughs> oh, hey, y'all. My daughter has moved salons. It's the same salon they've moved. So I'm going to go check that out. Post office, physical therapy. And then we're going to see Tina tonight. Um, I'm going to take it easy on the girls today. And we're going to try out the Yara. Um, I forgot what version this is. You know, there's a pink one, there's an orange one, and there's a white one. Actually, I'm not going to try that out. Yes, I am. Yes, I am. I already put on Baccarat lotion. Heads up. Ooh. The lotion and the um, shower gel, hand gel, does not... Mm -mm. That is a waste of $90. This is okay. It is the worst of the four colors. There's a pink, yellow, black, and white one. This is the last one I will grab for, but it's still okay. The black one is actually um, for men, and it smells like Dior Survive, so I really like that one too. But yeah, this is the last one I would. Mm -hmm. That just don't sit right in my spirit. It's not bad. And it's only like 20 bucks, but I give it a four. Oh, my battery, my battery. Actually, that rating is extremely low. It's not that bad. Um, or I wouldn't still have it. I give it around a, I give it a cool six. Give it a six. Y'all, these Canon, I use the Canon G7X or whatever, G's, yeah. Batteries last so long. I've been on this battery probably four days. That's the reason why I keep and love this camera, because I got the Sony too, but they about, <laughs> let me do this, <coughs> that battery die. Let me do this, that battery die. Let me say, it's your little auntie, that battery die, uh-uh. So it's pretty, pretty dark. So I'm going to have to get some light, some kind of light, because I got this so I can show y'all what I be wearing. And uh, you yeah, can't see. <laughs> That's a little bit better. This is a purple set from High Quality Fashion Boutique. There are a few still in stock. Probably not this color in my size, but. And then I got on these Ugg uh, boots like this. So let's go. Oh, mama needs some Windex. Yeah, we gonna pray that look how her Stanley Cup get her anxiety together, so I don't have to uh, drive Miss Daisy. But as long as I have to, I will. Okay, because I don't play with people' fears. All right, bye. All right, guys, I'll definitely do an unboxing when I get home. 
Um, I picked up a couple of packages. This scent is doing pretty okay. I'm smelling like toasted marshmallows and some type of fruit. Maybe peach. It's doing okay. It's worth keeping. It, it's very much putting me in the mind of something that's like mature and old school. Kind of like sort of on the white diamond tip. Kind of like it's something that I used to have too, but I can't put my mind on it. All right, y'all. So my last vlog, I was telling y'all about a meal I love and I said I wasn't going to tell y'all. But y'all know I ain't never been no gatekeeper. But I'm really a, the, at my big grown age again. I ain't learning my lesson because it already stays sold out. And I'm going to be real mad when I be coming and can't get it no more. But y'all need to taste this deliciousness. This is the best dang thing Panera got growing. Okay? Y'all know here recently I became a Panera addict. Only because stuff be good and fresh and not salty and greasy. and You know. But recently I fell in love with this right here. It is called the Chicken broccoli teriyaki bowl i ain't gonna lie this mug gonna hit you about a good 15 dollars with taxes i don't even know i just be swiping my card lord jesus where is the receipt i do know it's not inexpensive at all it's like ridiculously priced but for the caliber of the goodness of this bowl ooh, yes 13 19 14 28 with taxes for a dang bowl you can go jack the box and get a teriyaki bowl for five dollars. But this bowl only has oh, and tell them you don't want that baguette roll they just throw in a bag. Give you an apple. But this bowl is only like 200 calories. No joke. It has brown rice. I'm trying to do a review. Oh, see, so yeah, I don't lie my ass out that quick. It has 650 calories. But for a whole bowl, that is where did I get 210 or did I even say that it has cilantro brown rice roasted chicken thighs steamed broccoli teriyaki glaze sesame seeds and fresh cilantro when I say this shit so damn good whoo my opinion because y'all are running get it and be like it wasn't even all that did nobody tell you to run and get it did, no, did nobody tell you to <laughs> I just said I love it <laughs> Okay, Panera sponsor me, baby, because just wait, just wait, just wait. How this bowl finna blow up after after I say this? And they always out. He just had to check just now and be like, "Let me check and see if we got it." Y'all better have it, cause let me tell you something. I'm postmenopause. I'm irritable, and I will walk up in there and do nothing. I ain't gonna do nothing. I ain't gonna do nothing. But yeah, they had it. It be smoking hot too. Y'all be watching Freddie Jean. Eating good with Freddie Jean, boy. Let me tell you something. Ready to Gina show you that food. It don't ever look good, but she older, so we ain't gonna say no. It don't even touch her mouth, y'all. She be like, mm, mm, mm. girl, you ain't even tasted it yet. Yeah, mm. might not look that appetizing, but when I tell you, don't play about this bowl. Okay, guys, I was sitting here, I was going through my analytics, and it reminded me. You remember in my um question and answer where I was like, help y'all buddy out? Probably about seven you guys send sent about between five and twenty dollars each so it totaled probably like a little over a hundred dollars so my daddy used it to pay a bill but a lot of you guys did say y'all didn't want to be seen or because i said i would come back and show y'all because i didn't want people to think i was begging for money y'all didn't want to be seen or y'all didn't need me to prove anything so i never showed it i just wanted to come back and say thank you and I would let him say thank you, but I ain't at the house. If I remember when I get home, actually, I got to go to my physical therapy. And if he want to be on camera, I let him say thank you. But, um, yeah. Okay, so guys, I got a dilemma. You remember when I was building the purple beauty room? I was buying, like, a lot of uh, bougie bags just to, like, fill the cabinets because I'm not going to, like, technically wear those bags. They're just there for decoration. 
And then I got off track because I started buying everything else just because. And then I was like, why am I buying all this? Like, the point was to build my purple beauty room. All that other stuff I buy, why well, I want to sell it. But I can't sell it like just sell it because it's bougie items so i don't know what to do with it maybe i ask people locally and they can meet me to get it or some oh girl I'm out. child yeah what would y'all do huh what would, what would a plat brat do yeah i'm only telling y'all this and no i'm not gonna sell it because this stuff was 85 90 dollars I just want y'all to see how ashy I am. Mm. I can go to Dollar Tree and get that Dermacil or whatever it's called for a dollar twenty-five, and don't even be this this ashy. That's some of the best lotion ever, and it's a dollar. And I paid ninety dollars for some Baccarat lotion, and I'm ashy. Like, look in between my hands right here. I mean, fingers. Girl. All right, guys. So, I was dismissed today from physical therapy and etc. They told me to just call them if something starts to hurt again, which is good. I never, ever started coming to this stuff, like, for a payday. Actually, I wasn't even going to do it. Y'all remember? Y'all was even fussing at me. But being that I got hit by an 18-wheeler, my attorney is making me do all this. Like, I was just like, give me a shot of my shoulder and I'll be good. And my attorney is like, girl, that man was probably drunk or something. Go make sure you good, good. So, they told me to just call them if something start back to hurt again, which I will do happily. Do, 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 do. And they assigned me a life something something because they said this is pain that might gradually happens throughout my life or something like that. I don't want to talk too much about it because the attorneys and I let in the comments are going to go there and it's kind of telling too much of my business anyway. So let's go home and put some nails on. I might do toes, but yeah, we in 40, 50 degree weather. Ain't nobody seeing my toes. So I'm back with a treats box. <laughs> y'all do all little treats first of all the link will be below and my code is platinum d that will get you 15 percent off your first box all right so sugar gang here with me today good because she bid too much anyway but um what is this russia y'all know i always like the guests <laughs> Malaysia <laughs> what I'm always so off so basically treats is a box where you can try treats from all over the world guys I love these boxes I talk about them all the time me and my family enjoy them you will get a card in here that details every single treat that's in here in case it's in another language In case it's in another language or something. Oh, I see peach gummies. Y'all know how I feel about some peach. This box is lit. Child. Baby. Y'all heard some prawn crackers. Y'all remember when she was fell in love with those shrimp chips from the last one? What is this? This is a whole box or something. Oh, wow. 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 Ooh. I'm about to drop the whole box. But... Wow. Okay, let me sit this another way. So here's the whole entire box right here. It is full of goodies, guys. We got some rolls. They kind of like Swiss rolls. These are like chippies. You even got these little jello cups. Wow. Look at this. These little rolls. We have these. People um, eat them with their coffee. Here's a cake. A sponge cake. There's a lot of these little candies like this. Strawberry gummies. Here's a lot of them. These are potato crackers. Wow. 
that's a neat little container for them to be in, huh? I mean, packaging. Here's a oat cookie, dark chocolate. Look at this, potato biscuit, cheese. This is chocolate sandwich cookies. And here's another one of those jelly things. So I will leave the link to treats below, guys. Make sure you check them out. Each box is different. Sorry, guys, I went back and looked and these are boba tea candy. What was I talking about? <laughs> yeah, they're boba tea candy, but this is a very good box. It's not, a lot of these boxes be full of chocolate and et cetera. And it's a good variety in this one. Oh yeah, I got a little gift for whatever. <laughs> I forgot to tell y'all earlier. <laughs> or oh, whatever. <laughs> so I got some shades. Y'all know I love Versace shades and robes. I don't know about all that other stuff because it can get a little. Versace can get a little. Get, oh, I mean, I'm ghetto, but you know. But I love me some Versace shades. And I love me some Versace robes. And why did I just repeat that? I got the all black biggies. If you watch my vlog when I went to the casino, I had these on, but they were the gray mirrored with the gold hardware. I had to have these. I need it desperately some black on black sunglasses with no kind of nothing i didn't want gold hardware silver hardware that i can pair with <laughs> i'm too cool boy i'm too cool boy i'm too cool yeah i'm too cool for y'all <laughs> so i will link these below y'all super excited somebody just tried to steal my joy my comments under my video i just released go tell me to stop mentioning nicole every other sentence how she just left how we was married 14 years how that's still my best friend what you want me to do what you want me to do Let's, don't tell me to get back on the makeup channel i'm 43 years old my own daddy can't even tell me what to do <laughs> oh let me light my calendar back Iron Burning Peach Bellini. This is my favorite counter. It's soft, but it lights. What did I just say? Peach what? Peach. <gasps> it's motherfucking hot. Peach Bellini from Bath and Body Works. Like it's low too. I'm grabbing this like I'm. <sighs> All right. So guys, this is what I'm going to go with tonight. It's totally like different, but I need to be comfortable and don't want to wear a shape or an etc. And I'm going to pair it with these Kurt Geiger boots. Actually, let me check the temperature. I might switch this whole outfit. Yeah, we're going to wear this liquid legging outfit right here with my black cowboy boots because I want to be comfortable walking to the theater, in the theater, and don't have to wear a shape or an etc. I don't even think I'm going to wear a jacket. Maybe around my waist. All right, ladies and gents. I put a little powder on and some lipstick. And this is what we got. We look good enough to go see Tina, huh? Usually when I leave these plays, I stop by a bar or something afterwards. I'm not doing that tonight. I'm so not in the mood. So I'm going to put on BDK Velvet Tonka. I mean, I still can stop by a boy like this. I act like I look horrible or something, but I literally was thinking about like in a theater. Ooh, why don't I wear this a lot? Switching my tickets to another day, but I'm like, why? Girl, get your butt to that theater. Stop spraying this spray so much. I had got a long trench coat from um Shein. It's at the front though. I'm gonna put that on because it gets kind of cool in the theaters. I'm not gonna even switch purses or nothing today, but my purse is heavy. I need to take some stuff out of it. I'm gonna put um let me use something else. <laughs> let me use something else. Carolina Herrera in my hair. This is a hair mist, not a perfume. Or her perfume, not the actual perfume. Oh, that smells so good. It smell good, honey. Now that I don't put on the cowboy boots, chat, that's so comfortable. Let me show y'all. So I've beamed me up. I need to wash this mirror, guys. I did the floorboards. Yay to me. 
I washed the door handles and stuff. But now the mirror dirty. See, it's just a plain little set. Yeah, we gotta get that mirror together. Let me text you right now because she took my Windex to the salon. Who she think she is? Or who she think I am? All right, so I am gonna like jazz it up just a little bit with this jacket. I was gonna do that black trench, but I'm just gonna put this jacket on right here. This would have been a perfect opportunity for me to wear an outfit and get a mention on Instagram for a company. But, child, I'm a tired today. But we finna go, what will we What we do? What if I run into my OBGYN? Ah! All right, guys, so I'm headed in. I always get um, first class parking because who finna park all the way back there? And walk. Remember that one time when I saw a pretty woman, I had to get on that golf cart. There I go, right there. No ma'am. Never again. I mean, I'm trying. I ain't trying to sound like I'm, but baby, I'm at that age because I'm old where I'm gonna pay for convenience. Okay. They have their oh, Tina skirts on. Shake it, shake it, shake it, shake it, shake it, shake it, shake it. Shake it, shake it, shake it. <laughs> <laughs> Y'all look good. <laughs> <laughs> Alright guys, we are on intermission. So far, so good. I will give it maybe a 7 out of 10 so far. I'll explain why in the car. But yeah. I'm about to get locked out the theater. We got 3 minutes and I'm still in the pee line. I made it! There's a phrase that Everybody has been looking for this to take their pictures. <laughs> All right, guys, so I'm back in the car and I don't know what I'm doing because I am the person that usually sit in the theater and wait till all of this is out of the way. But I am so hungry. I'm like, maybe if I could get on out there. No, I'm finna just be sitting in the car hungry. Yeah, I got galore compliments. I was only able to um, catch one on camera. But oh my gosh, this is a hit. That lady said, you walked down the aisle, I smelled you, Andy. A big wheels keep on turning. Okay, bye. All right, y'all, so I've made it home. I'm over here watching Shuri the video. Well, she watching me, because baby, I'm going to have to rewind half the video. Let me tell y'all something. This right, hold on, let me pause you. Talking about some I don't deal with anyway, some espressos. This right here. I'm trying, y'all. Could easily be in my top five. I don't know how I slept on this. This is such a gorgeous scent. And I got it after I met the owner, so it's not signed. This is gorgeous. It's powdery. It, I, I smell the tonka in it is so faint. It's blended so beautifully, like that makes it like ve velvety. <laughs> this is good. Usually tonka can get a little bit because tonka is like, is it chocolate or coffee? It can get a little long, um, like artificial. This is bum. Let me tell y'all something. I got one, two, three, four. 
of the fragrances by him. I, that's that's why I ain't signed either. Oh, uh, I guess when I met him, I only had two already. Gris Charnel and Rouge Smoky. So, I love the way he signed our bottles. He customized them. So, this is the only reason why I haven't sold Rouge Smoking. Because it's not one of my favorites. But if y'all really want to know the truth, know the truth. It smells like love don't be shy to me. Girl, my light died. <laughs> Let's get that charged. But, said all that to say, that fragrance is bum. So, um... For my last vlog, you guys are telling me to take that mirror back. It's too small. Um, but I would if it was like for the living room. And I was trying to have that, I hate to say it, that YouTube look. But it's just a functional mirror for me to see myself in. Because the one I have hanging on the wall, which is not really a mirror, my jewelry is in it. <sighs> I finna say it don't really get it for me, but it kind of do. So I might go up one size, but I'm not trying to go the big old, big old mirror because that's not, I'm not trying to decorate. I want it functional. So yeah, me and my light clocking out tonight. It's the Nikki and the Maya show. I'm gonna take us some shots. <laughs> what do they call? Jelly cups. Hey, I don't know what flavors it is. Did it say it on here? Nope, I'm gonna just assume lime. And when you go assume orange, mm -hmm. I mean lemon. Lemon or pineapple. Ooh, cause it's a pineapple on the back. <laughs> Girl, how you do that? Ooh, <laughs> do mine. Why you got all this stuff? Don't get the other one then. They kinda have to like break it. Ooh, I almost dropped it. That tastes real medicinal to me. What it tastes like to you? Nothing. It tastes like nothing. Round two is the strawberry gummies. Mmm, real good. I just like, I'm, I act like a bad kid, though, because why did I have to do that? I already had a, some of these, you Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. Hey, what about in that jello? Huh? <laughs> Should say, don't think that Malaysia too strong. <laughs> she can't even get in the chips. They're prawn chips, which is prawn. What is the difference between prawn and, sh and shrimp? Mm -hmm. Is it bigger? That's what I was gonna say. But, uh, Girl, there's go a box cutter cut right there. Uh, Cause, <laughs> child. You send me sway. It's dark, Ooh. but this light yellow. Ooh, I'm like. <laughs> <laughs> Whoa! Baby Jesus. Ooh. I like your locker room used to smell. <laughs> <laughs> Some of y'all need to teach y'all daughters, baby. Go ahead. It's smelling like a, a, a school bathroom. <laughs> The other ones didn't taste like that. Mm-mm. The other ones didn't taste like that. That one tastes bad, but you know the other ones was good. Mm -hmm. These not that good. I take your word on it. Okay, you can try it. I take your word on it. Try Low pressure high. Things new 2024. <laughs> See, it's not nasty. It's just it's not nasty at all. They taste like something. It's that smell. I can't get it. It tastes like checks, checks mix a little bit. That's good. Mm -hmm. It's good. 
just not as good as my other ones. Yeah, it's good though. That smell. Woo! <laughs> you take your ass to sleep. I'm your headache. Hold on. Shh, don't say that. All right, guys. So sitting here, you guys remember I was saying I couldn't figure this out. I think I figured it out. I think I figured this. It smells like this to me. It smells like this to me. No, I'm sure yeah, I feel about you. You watch this while I do this perfume analysis. Alright guys, so I'm back. This is Mark Jacobs Perfect but the intense. Yep. 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 You wanna be on camera so bad. You wanna be on camera? Yeah, they can't. Morning, I'm gonna have to do some dirty work. So we're gonna go on with this $20, $20 Amazon scent. And that's why I haven't put any nails on. I'm gonna have to box and tape that mirror back up and get it back to Amazon. And go find, I'm gonna go find me one in store. Not too much, girl, you just going to the store. Let's go, wish me luck. Cause I'm not trying to be out all day. I love my home and laying in the bed here's the thing i would want something like this but something like this wouldn't even fit in my car and it's wood <sighs> i really hate doing this y'all i am not that person that get excited about decorating all my airbnbs somebody else oh i'm gonna leave their information below they charge like a thousand dollars per room which is damn cheap. Mm -mm. I do kind of want one of these benches too. I need to be in Ross. Mm, look at this one. See, this is more like if I wanted to put it in a living room. Child. Alright guys, I think I'm where I need to be. But like, if I'm not tripping, these same mirrors are, like, are on like Amazon for $59. Why would I pay a whole extra 100 Why? Y'all answer that. Y'all know everything. No, just <laughs> Okay, so let's just first of all I don't even have a basket very much unprepared let me put the camera down because I got a water bottle in the other hand so I can dig through let me tell y'all something I picked it up and it's a big difference big difference like weight wise weight weight wise really big difference I'm thinking about going with this one but the only thing about this one is I don't like this so you think this can be painted or this one, which is fifty dollars cheaper, is just square. All right, guys. So I have to measure first to make sure this even fit in my car. I saw one I wanted bigger, but I know damn well it ain't gonna fit. They are like shocked that I measured that right. <laughs> I mean, it's literally right here, so let me get home because, baby, one wrong move.
<laughs> Let's come from this angle. Way better, huh? Dang! My big back self. $99, y'all. And let me tell y'all something. Thank y'all for telling me you need a bigger one. Y'all know I don't mind y'all when y'all say it respectfully. So when I don't ask y'all peanut head asses. Yeah. Thank y'all. I love it. It's like this light frosted gold. I saw a wood when I wanted. Oh, y'all saw it. Let me beam me up. Shout it. Shout it. Swing my way. Show sure look good to me. All right, let's get this other one back so I can get my hot 40 back. I don't want no replacement. I don't want no exchange. Do I want it to my Amazon balance or do I want the money? <laughs> Might as well do it to my Amazon balance because I'm who going to shop anyway. All right, we're all set. Keep these slips until your money is back. On your quarter in your account. Now let me hit up Shug. Look at him. Let me hit up Shug and um, tell her to bring my Windex home because why would you take my Windex to the shop? and uh, they provide it at the shop she just be doing extra stuff and then i'm gonna run over my cousin's house because my little baby cousin done slapped his daddy and they ain't finna they ain't finna do him no any kind of way he didn't try to he ain't try to <laughs> now nah, he needs to be put on punishment and it ain't funny but what just make you slap your daddy <laughs> like why am i laughing it's just like what just make you just your daddy what one thing about me one thing about me i'm gonna get a kid's meal for my toy um yeah i'm gonna eat and then i'm gonna go to the prayer mountain don't sleep on sunny guy especially if you got a good one especially if you got a good one boy look at this man you need to pull your god dang pants up how your booty meat out hey but let me go because this is a truck stop and i don't need nobody thinking i'm a lot lizard but on the real, on the real, this truck stop got a barbecue place in it, a Sonic in it and everything. Get cute and come eat at this barbecue place. <laughs> Listen to your lit ain't. You know they got a job. You know they on the road. Y'all was on the road. <laughs> Bye, y'all. Let me tell y'all how busy the devil is. I said, I need to go to the prayer mountain and give thanks to the Lord. For seeing me through everything I done been through and still blessing me abundantly here lately. And I said, I'm not gonna even go because I know it's wet up there. I know it, it looks horrible up there and it's wet and it's blah blah blah. I had thirty thousand bucks. That's the devil. That's the devil. Up here, it's clear as day. And I was not going to come because of that. Don't let the devil do that to y'all. Oh, I can be thankful anywhere. But, 30,000 thoughts start running through my head. What if it's slippery up there? What if I can't get up there? What if I... Trying to stop me from coming up here. Also, if you come out here, be careful, y'all. Yes, you're at the prayer mountain, but everybody out here ain't holy, child. People pray on any situation they know a lot of people come out here they're vulnerable they're etc even if somebody say you need help or you want me to pray with you no i got this because you don't really know what people got up they sleeve texas don't care what it is they go represent ain't they ain't they <laughs> that's a cross over here let me show y'all the cross i'm doing over there got a little butterfly on it I know it was the blood. Look at me, don't take nothing serious. God know I'm goofy. Look at the view, though. Oh, this view is so beautiful when it's like not foggy outside. 
But yeah. It's a little chilly out here. Who I think I Ooh, this bench cold. Baby, this bench is cold. It might be wet. It is. Oh, I already got my refund that fast. So this is what my my prayers are usually very private because I pray for stuff. And just like I stopped doing vision board parties, um, I'm just in this era where you shouldn't let everybody know what you want, what you're praying for, what you're aiming for. Got stuff on my shirt. Yeah, I know it's been a long morning. So I usually come out here like at first I was out here and I was praying for clarity about my marriage, clarity about my job, clarity about this. And now I'm just out here. I'm thankful. Lord, I just want to thank you because I have been through so much these last three years. I'm still healthy as I can be. I'm still in my right mind. I'm still striving. I'm still helping others. I'm still in a position to help others. And I'm just grateful. Lord, I'm so freaking grateful. Thank you, thank you, thank you for not feeling dizzy right now, for not having to pay right now, for not having to worry about how I'm gonna pay for stuff, for not having to worry about my child, for clarity on anything I've ever asked you for. Thank you. Lord, I thank you. Quick review that I'm hopping in the shower. This right here lasts so long. Oh my gosh, for 30 something dollars. Mm -hmm. This right here, I forgot to tell y'all. It's like real tropical in my opinion. It's not for this season, but I wear my stuff when I want to. It's real tropical. I smell a little bit of pineapple, coconut. Not too much coconut. Yeah, it's really tropical. I'll just say that. And this is only like $17 on a good day. So. Yeah, this tray been showing out so far. Now this right here, but ooh, I know when I like a perfume because when I smell it, it make me feel tingly inside. Okay, honey, we are at the shower, about to um lay down and order some stuff off Amazon. We're gonna put on Mont Blanc. This is a beautiful scent. I didn't believe the hype about it, and then I went into dealers and I liked it. Got home started wearing it and it's just a no-brainer it's a no-brainer like baccarat where well, you can't figure out what you want to wear put this on it's soft it's light but it pack a punch mm, it smells so freaking good so i see y'all later i'm gonna wake up and i'm gonna try to do my nails toes and hair and makeup and we'll go from there bro look me and my wig tired of life why every time, every freaking time I go to sit down. Now, listening to YouTube, listening to YouTube, I had this calcium lime buildup in my toilet that was irking the heck out of me. So my cousin was like baking soda, blah, blah, all this stuff. Listening to YouTube, the shit gonna say get a pumice stone, right? I get the pumice stone and now my toilet gray. It scraped off all the paint or something. My toilet gray. So I'm just going to go to Home Depot and get a whole new toilet. I, yeah. I just told you, do not rush to be grown and get out the house. It is hard out here in these streets. Morning. Thanks to TikTok, I tried the new hack where you don't need tissue paper. And it works. It closes the bag. <laughs> All right, guys. I decided to go with that outfit I was going to wear the other night. This is like a little um, dress from Shein. And I got a Shein new bodysuit under it with these Kurt Geiger boots and this Gucci bag. That should be much better. It's 50 degrees outside, but I'm running in and out. I'm not going to be like standing out. I didn't do my makeup. I just put on some concealer. 
and some lip gloss and let's find us a scent to put on so yeah let's put on um instant crush this is said to smell like this is said to smell like baccarat <clears throat> i'm just spray the dress because i haven't ate last night yeah i guess what i ate last night some gizzards oh Ooh, dang what do those be Mm -hmm. I ate some gizzards and that was not good. I got a six piece, probably only got to eat like three because they were like too gizzardy. No meat, all that. I didn't put no nails on y'all. My presence is more than my appearance because if I sit up and be like, do my makeup, do my nails, it's going to slow me down and stop me <coughs> from going. So I said, get dressed. Pack that gift bag and let's go. Right, Who do I think I am with no jacket, a little short skirt? <laughs> let's go. But if you want to check in on one day, she gave me permission to vlog at her house, y'all. Y'all know. My check in time is 3 or 4. People's house is sacred. Look at the cake. I'm rushing. I can't get in the hotel because I'm going to give me some wings. I ain't got time to rush. I ain't got time to rush. I'm going to give me some wings. We did it again, y'all. Coordinate. Matching. <laughs> You gotta coordinate. Y'all know who this is. If you wait, hold on, let me show them. Y'all, you see that hair over there? Look, look. Edge, poking out that wig. Edge. This who made my drop shot. She don't play. Let me tell you how she don't play. This is, can I show them your kitchen? Yes. This is her kitchen. She got a whole nother kitchen. She make her drops. Cause she ain't contaminate nothing. Cross -contaminate. No cross contamination. She don't pop me. Brown you know. sugar fig don't have real brown sugar fig in it. Right. <laughs> Cause you made it on the same. Okay, we gonna stop. We gonna stop. Anyway, no, for her blog. <laughs> link below, y'all. Y'all know that you, they got a code. Yes, your code is always active. Okay, link below. <laughs> Look, I don't have no problem. I ain't no shame. I know my daddy was a pig farmer, and she would come running when he called the pig. <laughs> But my mama called her creek way because my mama would take her fish and she would sit down oh, by the creek and eat the ants by the creek. Uh, <laughs> oh, that's yeah. about ants. She was that's a delicacy. Ants. <laughs> <laughs> Look, you eat dirt, she eat ants. Hey, hey, happy <laughs> birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. <laughs> Fancy, uh, um, uh, what you call it? Not silverware because it's disposable. Look at this good Moscato. I just need to take a whole bottle. <laughs> All right, y'all, it was real, but I gotta go. I don't even know if I'm gonna make my second thing. It, it, it is at 4 30, and I'm literally 40 minutes away, guys. But it's not my fault. It initially was supposed to start at 4 30 but they changed the venue which made them have to change the time so it went from 4 30 to 2 30 and hey i already had this on my itinerary so i'm gonna stop in get a picture a hug and yeah i had to come to this though because you guys know Teresa is like my family now I ain't no like she is my family now like every wedding bridal shower whatever Teresa's at anytime anything go in my life Teresa um she's there so I was gonna be here for her family it was her sister party but it doesn't hurt to it didn't hurt me to stop by and bring a gift so um I missed the real important part her Teresa found her sister a perfume that their mom used to wear, and they both broke down real, real bad. But shit, I give that to Starting so. route to 4720 South Cooper Street. Everything ain't meant to be on camera anyway, so. Turn right onto Dartford Drive. Happy birthday, Tina. On to the next. Y'all can't even see At me. At the stop sign, turn left onto Hewlett. That's much better. So it's saying that I'm gonna get there at 4.05, perfect. <laughs> I can go out with a bang the last 25 minutes. 
let's go all right guys i'm already late um so i'm not taking this camera in with me i had to stop and get cash because i didn't have time to stop to get a gift but baby we all love cash now times is hard you can go in that store and get whatever you want <laughs> whatever you want so let's go no, you from you and Bree. Now Bree was on. She didn't slip down. Say hey. Say hey. All right. All right, bye. We're going into TJ Maxx, guys, since we're over here. See what they got. I ain't even got a big purse. Let's go. Oh, that line. If they got some, baby. <laughs> that line is motherfucking lining. It's like every time I'm getting out the car, that money bag, yo song be on. And I be singing in part because it, it still be in my head. Girl, this is one of them times. Child, it's one of them times. I hope I find some, but I don't. Because the lines is crucial. Like, but. Oh, no, no. Thank you. <laughs> I'm like, what I do? <laughs> Thank you, though. <laughs> I'm look, I don't even know what I'm looking for. It's something y'all been talking about. Chad, I'm just in here, honestly. But I do have some stuff at the house I could be doing. So, yeah, like, um, some stuff I just got from Amazon. Oh, see, what y'all be talking about will probably be over here because Y'all see it smell like herba pura. Something else. This must mean it's not meant for me to get jackpot. <laughs> Just playing. Look y'all, there's an alt fragrance in here. Bold love, inspired by love, don't be shy. Oh my gosh, if the line wasn't so long, I would get it for sure. get an attitude because why they don't carry my um jason's anymore so guys the line store right here then wrap right back up then you got to get to the register i think this this in a purple rose is not worth all that I and mean, i can come during the week while everybody at work what i see going out the door y'all remember i reviewed this 14.99 here <laughs> smell too good and they got a lot of them Baby, baby. I'll come back during the week. Cause, uh-uh. And I done got 5,000 compliments on this dress shop. For real. Like, all right, maybe not 5,000, 1,000. But I kinda wanna go right here to Red Lobster and eat. Fat self. My mood is off a little bit, so I'm trying to avoid going home, but I'm just go home, lay in the bed and watch me a movie. Or I might just give me some rest because I didn't get no sleep last night. I might just give me some rest, then try to hit the hit the town, y'all. Keith lives here and got all my friends who own restaurants in a frenzy. I'm like, child, y'all food is good. Hit my door if you want to, because you shouldn't have parked so damn close. I'm like, y'all food is good. So what are y'all worried for? Y'all food is excellent, honestly. Temperature dropping. Let me get in because I ain't got no coat on. I don't know. I guess that is nervous. It's just like being a celebrity makeup artist and you get to do Beyonce hell. I mean, not saying Keith Lee Beyonce status, but he can put your restaurant on like that. Like he that man is powerful. And he's a you can tell that he's literally a vessel. He said all the time and that he's anointed and so anyway yeah my mood is really off i ain't gonna discuss it on camera though because i've realized that this is not a safe place for me i say that all the time but like y'all but people can't comment on what i'm going through if i don't tell them what i'm going through so i'm just gonna stay focused See, now I can't go to this red lobster. I don't think I like this red lobster. 
baby, but I'm gonna go sit at the bar like they do on the movies and vent to the bartender. <laughs> you said you wanna find the best fried rice in your whole fucking life in the DFW. This is where you need to go to Hong Kong Market. It is in Grand Prairie slash Arlington. I originally went to Cocina Alina for the Lumpia, but they're closed on Sundays. So Bistro B is where I ended up going to, and then I shopped at the Hong Kong Market because my daughter loves the Rumbaton and the little drinks there. But baby, when I tell you that rice is so goddamn good, and they have so many different kinds. I just saw that they have a pork chop fried rice, but I got the queen fried rice, and it comes covered with a whole egg, and then there's different meats and stuff, and there's scallions. Oh, rice didn't stand a chance. We had this pre-gaming before our talk. Get you some. So you said you want to find the best. And I am. Well, I guess this is something you do during the week, too, because I done drove out of my gas trying to find a parking spot. I mean, it's a movie out here. I ain't never in my life seen nothing like this, baby. We making spots, parking across the street. Let's go. Yeah, it's a million places up here, and she was not really clear on where exactly she went, so I got attitude. Guys, so it is actually Bistro B. This is what it looks like. I got the egg rolls. Y'all know I love egg rolls, and they said they are the best egg rolls ever. And I'll show y'all the rice when I get home. Y'all know the Chinese New Year is coming up. I'm trying to catch it. <laughs> Hold up. I'm catching it. The rice got a whole fried egg on it. A whole one. <laughs> home sweet home, honey. And baby, if you didn't know, I am an egg roll head. When I, I didn't even taste the rice yet. Look at my egg roll. Okay. It is so good. Baby, the velocity. Huh. Y'all need <laughs> Y'all being nosy. Y'all being nosy. Of the egg over the shrimp and chicken fried rice. They even got pork chop fried rice. I even heard they got oxtail fried rice. Now don't quote me on that. Don't quote me. Just add, just add. Baby. Let's see. Let's see. Hold on. Yeah, I am eating in the bed. Why not? I ain't like somebody over here with me. I ain't like I can't just watch. Uh I want some hot sauce, some sweet and sour sauce on this so bad, but I'm already flared a little bit. Cause I ate that shrimp for that shrimp boil the other night. I had been eating it like three days in a row, y'all. <laughs> I could have bought groceries. And the last night Suge bought it for me and got medium instead of mild, and it was a little bit too spicy, but it was a little bit too good and it's done backfired on me. Mmm. I got a compliment. That's a baby shower. Instant crush. I need to say, you always smell so good. <laughs> I try. My ex boyfriend, the one who always be buying me all the gifts, said I got a natural scent to me. Like, he said it's real hard to explain. Like, he would literally just. Snip up and down my arm straight out the shower with nothing on me. It's weird. People body chemistry be so different. But what's also weird about that is I can get musty. Ain't can. That's my. I ain't gonna say it because they already done. Uh, most likely, but my daddy side of the family thing. I can. That's why it took a minute. I mean, so that's why I'm very cautious of 
when I shower and how many times I shower. Because I know, baby, I can cut up. <laughs> this is too good, y'all. 10 out of 10. 10 out, and it was only like, shout out. The egg rolls were two for a dollar. I should have got a whole dozen. What was I thinking? So, this was probably $12. Yeah, I should daddy a foodie just like she is. I don't have to call him rub this in his face. The, the, yeah. I'm already a fried rice egg roll type person. This shit right here. Whew. Hit. Hey, let me tell y'all something. Ain't nothing like spending your money on food and it's good. Cause oh my gosh. Yes. Before my camera died, I went against Ozempic. My last video, a lot of you guys, no, 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 especially if you got stomach problems. It's the reason why my OBGYN asked me when is the last time I had a colonoscopy. I went against it. I didn't even go pick it up, so now he gonna be fussing because, you know, doctors really get mad when you don't pick up your prescription. It makes no sense. I have to stop myself and eat this. It's still hot. I done made it all the way home and I almost ate all of it. And it's still hot. That's dangerous. Baby, let me see if I can fit this hoodie. Oh, this is medium. <laughs> So I think I'm satisfied guys. That is super bright. Just needed a little refresh. Just a little, not nothing major to elevate my mood. Wasn't really trying to decorate, I just needed to elevate my mood. So yeah. Y'all know something, Nicki Minaj has really pissed me off. First of all, she's way too old for everything she's doing. And it's just like, we all have people like that in our life. Because to me, I feel like Nicki been not liking Megan. Ever since she did that collab, the first collab with Cardi B. And she was just waiting on any little thing so she can explode and show her true colors like she's doing now. Like, she really had a problem with Megan doing that collab. And instead of taking it to the booth or something, she's been on a damn near 70 hour spiral. And Megan ain't even did shit to her. Get in the booth. We don't want to hear you crying. First of all, Megan is almost half your age. You want to bring up her dead mama. You want to bring up Pimp C and Bum B, who we do not play about in the South. To my, that's how Megan rap all over one line like you been having all this stuff in the arsenal ready to release it but you couldn't just do it out the blue because then everybody would see how crazy you are so you waiting until this girl said one thing and now you got 70 hours of stuff to say about her and y'all ain't gonna even lie that's that's the main reason why my my contact with females don't got real real slim because there's a lot of Nicki minajs out here I wanted to come back because I just realized, I don't think I told y'all that I didn't like Tina. I didn't know how to say it because I know artists are super sensitive about their ish. But I talked to my brother about it because you could know my brother has been on numerous Broadway plays. He's been singing his whole life. And he was like, it's okay to feel like that. Just don't be disrespectful and nasty with it. I don't feel like her voice was strong enough. I feel like she sound more like Jennifer Hudson instead of Tina Turner. I don't even think she could dance like at the end when we got to uh, come close and dance with him. She couldn't even do the Tina spin, right, baby? If you can't do the do, if you can't, baby, if you can't, hey, if you can't hit it, baby, now nah, what is you playing Tina for? You know what I'm saying? And then before intermission, we was already on. Oh, I think I did. Expl I did say all this. We was already on when Tina beat Ike up and ran to the hotel in Dallas. And then after intermission, people just started leaving. It was so boring. When they was talking about her living in London, it was so boring. Like, snooze boring. I was in my phone answering YouTube comments. Um, And the little girl who played Tina, bum. Then it was one of you guys messaged me and said, y'all left out because they didn't do Tina no justice. 
I cannot wait to talk to y'all homeboy and see what he got to say, Mr. OBGYN. Because, you know, he, he said he didn't like Michael. He said, I wish I would have got it on camera. He said he didn't like the way the Michael dude drug his words. So he'll be like, you know what I mean? Come and see me. Like, I, the way my... Um, the way my doctor did it was just too funny so the best thing i've um watched on broadway dallas so far has been pretty woman yeah as i'm sitting in this car waiting on something i see why my ex didn't want me in these streets they love me out here <laughs> nah but on the real i just <laughs> i play all day y'all i put a poll up on instagram and i was like when people are rebrand to be more appealing to companies does that make them a sellout and a lot of y'all are saying nope 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 but chat i read it and heard it and see it under so many videos as soon as somebody start acting in a, a different type of way y'all oh you don't act the same no more oh i don't like it now that she it's just like we can't win on this her network that's why you just need to do what you need to do he is hot who he fussing at sugar what he saying he can't even sit still listen shh. we wouldn't be able to understand him anyway he's not even talking in english oh shit. <laughs> i think her stanley fake candies because why your ice be melting <laughs> baby treating me to a bun cake we're at nothing but cake if you have never had them just just go on just unsubscribe because i mean no 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 don't unsubscribe don't unsubscribe they got the best freaking cakes ever and literally you can get a cake today eat on it tomorrow the next day the next day and two weeks later your cake is still fresh i don't know what they putting in them the flavors are so good they got flavors that they keep in stock and then they have seasonal flavors they'll bring like it's valentine's day so they'll bring like a strawberry cream in oh my gosh they cakes are so good y'all we ain't even think about dinner we just came to get cake so she got lemon i didn't know them like that that's why i didn't remember and i got carrot i love carrot cake i'm probably the only one but yeah 